Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, here we have another weird video today. A video that I just came up with and I don't really know where this is going, but I'm just going with the flow. Here's the thing, I'm in quarantine, I'm super bored, and me like all the other humans that are in quarantine are probably with a huge urge to change something about themselves like hair i was reading the other day like a study not like a study more like an article about three of the most searched things during the month of march which was the month that we started quarantine and stuff was like how to cut your bangs at home how to cut your hair at home and how to dye your hair at home so yeah it's not just me i think everyone is feeling that because since you cannot change anything else right now you cannot go out you can travel you can do anything fun i think people really want to do something dramatic to themselves and experience something new and i can feel that because i want to do that too actually i know by experience that this hair color which is my natural one dark brown almost black is like the best hair color for my face like i used to dye my hair a lot in like college and high school i really love dyeing my hair but the truth is this color is actually the one i feel that suits me the most but that doesn't mean that i still want to experiment some others because you can have that perfect dress in your closet that just fits you perfectly but that doesn't stop you from buying new ones right it's the same thing for hair i feel like this color is the best for me but it doesn't mean that i don't want to experience others so i was already before all this happened i was already planning to dye my hair first i thought for coachella then coachella got cancelled then i thought i would dye my hair for my trip to japan and the trip to japan got cancelled so i'm getting enough of it and i think i will do it either way even if i don't have anywhere to go so yeah i'm getting really excited lately to do something about this hair of mine and i was just doing my business on instagram when i got a dm from a brand that sells wigs and i'm usually not a person that wears many wigs i usually have a hard time because i have a lot of hair to put inside the wig and also because i really don't like how the hairline looks on the wigs but i gave it a try and i checked their website and surprisingly i found a lot of wigs there that have bangs like me so i'm not used to seeing much of those and i got really excited because first you don't need to hide the hairline because you have bangs so it will look much more natural and second they have such amazing colors and some of them are exactly what I envisioned when I thought that I was dyeing my hair so all those things combined made me think maybe I should order a bunch of wigs in different colors that I like all with bangs, try them on and see which color works the best for me and that way maybe it will help me to decide which color I'm going to dye my hair so the brand that I was talking about is called UV Me you buy me i'm not sure how you pronounce this but it's a super like kawaii japanese vibe store that not only sells wigs but like clothes and accessories all very in the kawaii type of vibe so let's start this without further ado let's go before i try this i want to do something to my hair i just washed it so it's wet but it's always a struggle to hide my hair underneath the wigs because I have so much hair and so long but I feel like French braids always work the best so I'm just going to part my hair and I'm just going to brush this part this is not a French braid tutorial video so I'm not going to be very like meticulous about this from here I divide in three pieces and I just start passing the pieces underneath one another I start just grabbing hair from the sides and mixing them together okay so we have our braids done they look like trash I know but I wasn't really careful making them because you just want the braids to hide their hairs so there's no need for them to be perfect now with all this extra braid we have here I'm going to just make a little roll here behind my hair like a little twirl and just clip it with hairpins and you end up with this kind of midsummer hairstyle <laughs> I'm gonna show you how it looks in the back now I'm going to use one of the caps that came with the wigs and I'm gonna use the black one and it looks like this okay like this put it here here it goes I'm gonna try this let's see how I look blonde with bangs so I start here on the top I try to hold it with my hands and then just pull it back <laughs> who am I? but this looks very good I'm so surprised 
I kind of love this color, what do you guys think? And this is like a honey, very pretty blonde It doesn't look like me, it's so weird I just feel like a different person <laughs> This is so weird I like these curls too And the texture of the hair is so good, so soft I want to show you like the full length of this I actually really like the length too I think I, I need a cut Because my hair is so long right now And I feel like this size is kind of a good size Should I dye my hair this color? I'm really digging it and I wasn't expecting This is one of the colors that I chose like last minute <laughs> Maybe this video instead of helping is going to make it worse Like I can't choose now But we have a lot of weeks to go through So I think this is enough Otherwise it's going to be a long video But I'm just feeling myself with this one Okay, let's move on. So next week is actually almost the color of my shirt, which is a very like grayish blue that I am so in love with. I love like pastel colors that have a little bit of gray, if you know what I mean. While the blonde one was wavy, this one is completely straight. I love blue hair. Oh my gosh. I don't know what you guys think. It's so pretty. I just love blue. And the fact that it matches like the clothes that I'm wearing today, it's like an extra point. I think it's so pretty First of all, all the wigs, like I'm falling in love because the fact that I don't need to hide like the hairline the bangs help a lot and I'm so used to see myself with bangs that it makes it extra easy to embrace these colors It's like my mermaid dreams coming through and it's very long so it's more similar to the hair length that I usually have like my own natural hair length I would die if I had this color like probably so hard to achieve but if I had it like all my dreams will come true I love this so much this might be the one guys I don't know <laughs> okay this one is not really my style I don't know it's too much like Halloween-ish I don't feel it's really my vibe it's a cute wig and the waves are really cute but I don't know the color I'm not really feeling it and it makes me feel so pale it's a pretty hair color but I just don't think it's for me. What do you guys think? Please rate them all. Like do one, two, three, four, five. There are going to be five. And give me your rate like from one to ten. I don't know, maybe you guys are going to go crazy in the comments like that was the best one. <laughs> but even so I wouldn't dye my hair this color because I don't think I would like it. But it's cute. It's cute. Okay, so next one is actually the short hair one. So I'm not only going to see myself in a different color but with a different length. And I haven't worn like short, like a short bob in ages And it's green I absolutely love green I've been so obsessed with like matcha green And this is like perfect Okay, this is actually very cute It's very different, but very cute But I'll probably not do this cut I would actually prefer it to be like this straight than this shape because I really don't like the shape so I think I will eventually cut this wig like this eventually to use it more I feel like Midoriya shone in with this <laughs> I don't know, all of the wigs are so pretty don't you guys think? and they are so soft to touch and I could do like some buns over here I think this would be so cute Okay guys, let's move on to the last one and this is probably my favorite color of them all and that's why I left it for last This is like a super beautiful pastel pink with a lot of grey in it It's like the perfect shade Like the wig is so soft and the color it's so like... perfect I don't even have words for this But it's just like the perfect blend It's like pink hair but it's not like in your face pink, you know what I mean? Let me just bring to the front and try to make this look more natural Well, this is going to be very hard because the blue I don't know why, it just made me feel so good But this one is pink, you know? <laughs> pink always wins I really need your opinion on this, guys So help me out in the comments The color, I mean, the color is like everything I could wish for It's like mermaid dreams And I can definitely see myself styling this so many different ways Oh my gosh yeah, like this I really want to dye my hair this color It's weird because I will rate this like a 10 out of 10 And I will rate the blue a 10 out of 10 too Look at them They are so perfect, I don't even know So let me know in the comments which one you guys think I should do Help me out, please <laughs> Also guys, if you want to check 
Yuvimi or however this is pronounced. I'm going to leave below the links to all these wigs. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and also follow me on the other platforms like TikTok and Instagram, it's Iris Love Unicorns for all of them, but either way I will leave all the links on the description. So yeah, that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching and I see you guys on the next one. Bye, love you.